Hi you guys, Lindsay here. Welcome back to my channel. Today I have a really exciting project to show you. If you saw my Style Maker Fabrics Spring Swatch video, then you know they've gotten a ton of amazing fabrics in for this season. And Michelle let me and the rest of the blogger team have free reign over the entire collection. So without further ado, here's what I made. Ah, isn't it great? Okay, first things first, the jacket. I used a Simplicity So Stylish pattern number 1467. This is my second time making this jacket, so I was able to make a few changes to get the fit just right. I took out a small quarter inch wedge from the center front, and I reduced the sleeve length by about five inches. The fabric is Style Maker Fabrics textured linen in solid navy. It's a medium weight linen with a distinct texture. It has amazing body and surprisingly a really nice hand. It's not itchy at all like some linens can be. It also comes in sage, black, flax, and taupe. It was really great to work with too. I washed it in cold water on a gentle cycle and dried it on low heat. It did shred a little at the cut edges, so you might consider searching those edges before you wash them to prevent that. While sewing, I used a universal needle, size 80, and regular polyester thread. It pressed really nicely, but you do need to lower the heat setting on the iron a bit to prevent it from burning, which you can see when the fabric shines in the areas where it's gotten too hot. Despite the texture, the interfacing adhered perfectly with no issues. As part of my New Year's resolution to focus more on upgrading my finishing techniques, I finished the insides with Hong Kong seams and bias bindings. The fabric looks great as a jacket, but honestly, it would also make amazing linen pants, shorts, a skirt, or even a shirt dress. The possibilities are truly endless with this amazing textile. Now, let's switch gears and talk about this amazing maxi dress. I'm a little obsessed with butterflies, but TBH, I didn't even really notice this fabric on the first pass of swatches. But when I realized it was butterfly wings, I was hooked. I love how it's such a grown up, elegant version of a quote unquote animal print that is typically so young and girly. Big girls can wear butterflies too, and this fabric is the perfect example of that. The fabric itself is a rayon crepe, which is easily one of my top three fabrics of all time. It's slightly heavier than rayon chalet with a subtle texture, but still has the super soft hand and amazing drape that chalet does. Style Maker Fabrics has about a zillion different rayon crepe prints right now. A bunch of them I covered in my swatch video, so go check that out for reference. I used a Microtech needle in size 80 and the thinner Guterman Mara 120 thread. I washed the fabric in cold water and even dried it in the dryer on low heat. Not all rayon has to be air dried. I was able to iron it on the rayon setting of my iron with steam without issue. Honestly, you guys, this fabric is foolproof. The bodice of this pattern is fully lined, so I didn't treat those raw edges at all. But for the skirt, I did sew French seams. The hem, which is 90 inches long by the way, was sewn with my narrow hem foot. The fabric works best for drapey patterns like flowy tops, dresses, and skirts. The more pleating, gathers, and blousing, the better. I actually used two patterns for my maxi dress. The bodice is this Rebecca Taylor for Vogue pattern number 1344, and the skirt is M7381. It was really important to me to maintain the high-low waist seam, which proved to be a little more difficult than I thought to pull off. It's not as dramatic as I wanted, but it's still there. I love how the sleeves are a slight nod to butterfly wings when they flutter in the wind. And can we talk about this pleat detail? There are so many pleats in this pattern creating a wonderful blousiness you can't get without them. I also love how the wrap bodice is still modest and doesn't open too low on the chest. Well, there you have it, my Style Maker Fabrics Spring Blog Tour 2017 outfit. Thank y'all so much for watching. Please be sure to check out all of the other amazing ladies on the blog tour with me. There have already been some amazing outfits with so many more to come. Next up is the adorable Helen from Helen's Closet. Shout out to the Canadian sewists like her. See y'all soon. Bye.